Why, hello there, racing kart fans. It is I, uh, Mr. Mike, and you are watching a Let's Play here uh, that I'm doing a little bit later than usual. That's a good game. Enjoy your game. Yep, got to do that. How about this? Sort of like that, but in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe uh, Edition. Uh, I don't think they have Trackmania sounds. Anywho, we're here. We're here to race. Uh, I know it came out a few weeks ago, but uh, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Edition for the Nintendo Switch came out with the final DLC, at least that I know of the final DLC. I'm pretty sure it's the final DLC because I doubt they're going to have anything else beyond that, except some maybe updates and tweaks and stuff. But the final Wave 6 of the DLC for Mario Kart 8 Deluxe is here, ready to go. So why don't we let's go and play ourselves some Wave 6 of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe DLC. Because uh, it is a very interesting uh, amount of tracks that you get and uh, kart racers. And we're going to try out a little bit of everything. Because why not? Because I love me some Mario Kart, and I love me a lot of options. And right now, uh, if you're just getting a Nintendo Switch now, well, I guess better late than never. Even though I would wait uh, until next year, because you never know that Switch 2 might be dropping next year. And if it does drop next year, or they do announce the, the Switch 2.0, and it's backwards compatible with... Uh, original switched uh, cards, then you're going to want to get, uh, you know, the game for that. If they don't have the next game out already, because that could be another thing, too. They could, for launch, have the next Mario Kart game, because they are supposedly working on a, the next Mario Kart game for the Switch, whatever it's going to be called, the second, the new Switch. And, um... I don't know, but I would still, I would still definitely buy this one, uh, especially if it's going to be backwards compatible. But hey, if you're late to the game, or if you just own the Switch all this time, and you don't even own Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. What, what are you waiting for? Why didn't you get it? Then you must not be a racing, a, a racing kart fan, because then why would you buy it? Otherwise, if you own the game and you never bought the DLC, go get the DLC. What is it, like 20, 30 bucks, something around there? Well worth the price of a mission because you get all the track, all the many, many, many more tracks and characters and stuff that they just totally threw in into this kart game. So definitely, definitely worth it. So we're going to go, we're going to have ourselves some Mario Karting fun here. And we're going to be playing, uh, playing, driving a bunch of these tracks and uh using different characters to do so so let us go and play ourselves some mario kart 8 deluxe now let me see if i can get this right here there we go <coughs> so let me get situated get my earbuds in so i can listen to the game and we're gonna go to grand prix I like to do, I'm a little bit of a, you know, it's been a little while for me and my hands aren't working as they mostly would do, so we're just going to do 100cc. I know that's probably slow for a lot of you uh, big league players, Mario Kart players out there, but that's me. Uh, I already was uh, playing this game a little bit. I was doing uh, some characters and racing all the tracks already, so... I pretty much know what's going on. So we got Diddy Kong as a Wave 6 uh, new DLC character. Uh, we got Funky Kong. We got Pauline, which I, of course I picked her because she's rocking that uh, sexy motorcycle. Look at her rocking that motorcycle. And then you got some me stuff like uh, like me with the box, question mark box in my head. <laughs> uh, so pretty interesting stuff oh and plus you get peachette that's another that is the final dlc character so peachette go figure they got a peachette but not a bowsette yet come on nintendo 
Come on, let's get brave a little bit. Let's get the Bowsette. Everybody wants Bowsette. I know we all want Bowsette, so we might as well bring out a Bowsette. If you got Peachette, why not a Bowsette? It just makes sense, right? Right? Female Bowser? Bowsette? Okay. So we're going to start playing as Pauline um, in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. You know, in, in the Mario Kart carts in general, uh, picking the characters never really does anything for you. It's not like it changes how your race or races or anything. It's just, you know, you like your favorite characters or something. You want to race them. So you just go and race them. It's not like, oh, yeah, I, I just, I feel like if I picked a baby Peach or something or a baby Daisy, they'll go extra fast or something down the courses. I, I never seen that. I never, like Larry, the Koopa kids and stuff. It's not like if you pick a certain character, they give you certain stats or boosts or anything. They don't go that far into a Mario Kart game. It's only a shell over the cart. It's all about the Mario Kart. And you know what? It depends on how you race and all that. If you can beat the game or not. So we're going to play as Pauline to start off here with. As she goes. Uh, I guess I'll unlock someone else here. Ah, I unlocked myself uh, another parachute. MKTV. Okay. So I'm going to keep the bike that I have. And what? Why don't we... Oh, we also got a flower. Um, let's get the rainbow parachute. She seems like a rainbow kind of girl. Then we're going to go up. We're going to go to the final... Final two, because... Uh, let's see here. These were... Let's see here. I'm trying to remember. So it's Midriff Drive, Zelino's Ice World, Bowser Castle 3, Rainbow Road. I forgot it. Yeah, DK Mountain and Rome, Daisy Circuit, Piranha Plant Cove. These are also some of the new DLC because these, these were the ones from the last one. So it's these and these. So these are the final two... Uh, Wave 6 DLC, if I am correct on that, which a lot of times I'm not, so I always have to check myself out. Uh, DLC, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Uh, here we go. Um, courses. Let's see here. Mario Kart 8. There's Funky Kong, Doki Kong, Pauline. Um, let's see here. So, yeah, DK. Okay, so DK run. Okay, these are all the courses that have been in it. Okay. I just wanted to triple check and make sure because my brain <laughs> also doesn't work half the time. So I want to make sure I'm given the correct information. So, yes, Rome Avante from Mario Kart Tour, uh, from GameCube, Donkey Kong Mountain, from the Wii, Daisy Circuit, uh, Piranha Plant Cove is a new one, hence why it doesn't have like any of the other, you know, system names on it. Piranha Plek Cove is the new one. And then you got from Mario Kart Tour, Madrid Drive, from the 3DS version, Rosalina's Ice World, which I don't remember Rosalina's Ice World from the 3DS version, but that's just me. Uh, from the SNES, Bowser Castle, Castle 3, which they revamped that, made it 3D and not just the 2D. It would be probably pretty funny if it was your characters were all 3D and the, the, and the course was 2D, that would have been pretty funny. I would think. I don't know. Maybe if they, you could switch between them. And then, of course, from the Wii, Rainbow Road. Because why wouldn't we not want more Rainbow Road? So we're going to start off over here. We're going to play these courses first, and then we'll get into the other courses with a new, another character. Have ourselves some Mario Kart fun! Yeah. 
There's Pauline. It's kind of interesting she wags her butt back and forth. I don't know what that means. I'm just a dirty, dirty person. But seeing her wag her butt like that, it, it's kind of funny. In a dark, in a dark, dark Mr. Mike kind of way. All right, remember, this is old freaky gamer you're watching here, folks. So I'm old, I'm a gamer, and I'm kind of freaky, so can't judge. No judging. This is a no judge video. Okay, as I... Yeah, there we go. Okay, this is where I always get confused. I'm like, where do I go? There we go. Did I get nobody? No. Uh, of course they're gonna get me. Because why wouldn't they not get me? They always get me. It's just because I'm in first place. They're jealous. How did he get in front of me? this course oh I'm gonna get hit by a blue shell ah! right on the final lap well, at least it was now and not right before I hit the hit the thing oh look at that oh look at that some skills. I got this girl's got some skills, folks. Ah, uh, here we go again. It ain't Rosaline. I don't know. Oh, there we go. Throw a banana. I pretty much got this in the bag. Oh man. I could have been floating. And for the win. And I got all a bunch of crap on my face. Cause they shot me with ink at the very last second. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Next race with Rosaline. Like I said, th this game is fun. I always pick this up a bunch of times once in a while. It's a good go-to once in a while kind of game. I just want to do a little simple racing, you know, nothing real like Forza Motorsport and stuff, but something fun and all that. I don't know why she's shaking her butt like that. It's like she's taunting you to want to get her or something. It's... It's like a weird thing. I, does the other characters do that as well? I, when I play as the other characters, I gotta find out if they do the same thing. Because I have never noticed. Woohoo! Because I never noticed other characters doing that. It seems kind of uh, a little interesting on, on, on why she's the one that does it. Yeah, yeah, DK. I'm just thinking of Seth Rogen. DK, don't you call. Oh, watch out for the green shell, girl. Shop for your own banana peels. Hell yeah.
There we go. Gotta go around. This course is so nice. Oh, oh, I almost went off the edge there. That would have stunk. I did that before a couple times. Oh, here we go. Of course. So jealous, these characters. Nothing more than a bunch of self-centered uh, security carts. Oh no! Well, at least they have it before I went into the tunnel. That's always a good thing. I don't mind getting hit with blue shells, red shells, or any shells. Just as long as I'm not at a point that's going to affect me much. Nice tight handling, girl. Uh, here comes a blue or red shell. Sorry, red shell. Don't know what my blues from my reds, but it doesn't matter. Let's who, look who's coming. Look who's winning. Look who's first place. Isabelle's on my butt. Isabel is on my booty. Isabel's craving that win. Gotta watch out. That Isabel from Animal Crossing. She seems like a gentle folk. She seems like she's sweet and kind and a she's got a dark side to her in this game. Very dark. And there's the butt wave. Look at that, I never noticed. Hey, Wario. Boom. Boom. Yeah, Wario. Okay, at least I didn't get nothing yet. Oh, and a blue shit. Oh, oh, shit. Oh. Even when I go through here, they, it doesn't help. It doesn't help I'm going super fast. I'm still got redified and blueified, but it didn't stop me from being at first. Going to be first. Wow, that seems kind of early for the blue shell. Usually you don't get like a blue shell until like. I don't know. You think like mid to end of the of the uh, race? Getting hit by that. I wish you can look behind you. I'm always trying to think, oh, how do I look behind me? my character like other racing games and I'm like oh this isn't like other racing games you cannot look at behind your character to see how close these people, others are you have to play it oh you're gonna have to play uh a 
Forza game. Go, Rosaline! You're almost there, don't get caught up. Come on, go, go! There we go. I win! Look at that! Sorry, Isabel. And Wario, Isabel's still in second. Isabel's like, I'm gonna get ya! How you she driving without holding on to the bike? That is impossible! Or very improbable, because you could... You can do that. I could do that on a bicycle. Not on probably on a motorcycle, but I could do that on a bicycle. Craziness. Just crazy. Crazy race time, racers. We're on a plant code. There she goes, shaking her butt. I don't know where I'm going. Ah, oh, it's a piggy cooper fish! Yep, that's from another franchise. If people haven't watched uh, Star Wars Episode 1. With Jar Jar Binks. Ah, it's a bigger goober fish! Ah, bigger goober fish! Ah, lots of goober fish! She sings? Okay, I guess you like singing, girl. Okay, I guess a red shell is coming, but it must have got blown up by my bomb. Nice. I wasn't even trying for that. I was just waiting for another person to come around. Oh, no. Blue shell. Ah, you blue shell. Oh, well, I st still got my item. That's good. Woo! Here we go, the race of the day, Daytona. Only if Daytona wishes it could be this exciting. Woo, look at that, woo! Look at me doing tricks. I ain't never do tricks. I, I forgot that you could do tricks. That's okay. I got shrunk, but I am still in the lead and I'm still winning. Hence why I'm in the lead. Oops. Ah, now I'm going to drive badly because that's how I do things when I'm not paying attention to it. <laughs> Can I fly? Yeah. Yeah, jumping tricks. Yeah, yeah, girl. Yeah. You show show us what your uh, daddy gave you. Or digital daddy or what. <laughs> I don't think she has a dad. I don't know. Maybe it's in the lore somewhere. But I don't know if Pauline has a dad. Pauline, you got a father, mother, father? Who are they? Do you want to date Mario? She, be, she becomes Maya. Ooh, Maya. As you can see, I won the circuit. I won the Mario Kart. I'm not going to have to show this. 
Yeah, three stars, 60 points. Pauline, or Isabel, is right behind me. But she couldn't take me, folks. Peach, all the way at the bottom. And, uh... Mario wasn't driving in this, but... <laughs> That's funny. Peach, you were dead last. Okay, let's go back to the 100ccs again. We'll pick a different character. We'll pick uh, Funky Kong. We'll keep the same stuff because we want to see if he shakes his butt. And we'll go on to this side. And we'll do the new courses here. And then when we get familiar with all the new courses, then we'll go back and do the other characters. Show off their driving karting skills. Okay, got a lovely time. Oh yeah, he does shake his butt a little bit. Okay. So it, it isn't just Pauline that does it. They all do it on the motorcycle. Okay, I got it. I guess it makes sense. Whoop. Oh, I wasted a red shell. What was I doing? I don't know what I was doing. Donkey Kong got outed. Bowser's in the lead. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, I'm doing bad. That's only because I'm not paying attention. But I'll fix that. Donkey, go! What are you doing? I was... What is he saying? What is he doing? Oh, what am I doing? Uh oh, what am I doing? Funky Kong! What am I doing? <laughs> oh my god, how did I get turned I don't... Guys, please, I kid you not. I think I zoned out for a second. It's been a long day. And I zoned out, but that's okay. That's... That's okay. That is a-okay, okay, folks. Watch this. I might have been, uh, I might have lost my first place, but I'll get it back. And look who went to first. Sorry, Donkey. I'm not letting you beat me, Donkey. Like I said, I'm a little tired today. Been a long day. Had a lot of stuff going on. But that ain't gonna affect me. I'm gonna beat this. I'm gonna get first. Hey, here we go. First place. Woo! Even though I went all the way to fifth, I got fit first. Beat my cousin Donkey. Beat my cousin Donkey Kong. Yep, yep. Look at me flex. Look at me flex my muscles. 
Even though I think it's just Donkey Kong in a muscle shirt and some sunglasses and a bandana. But that's easy for them to make. Okay, I think I had some trouble in the ice world. I don't know. Something with cold and ice. <laughs> Look at how Donkey jumps every time. I do that. Go, go, go! Sir Sub Dude, Big Kahuna coming through the ice. He doesn't do anything. He doesn't do no flips or tricks or anything. I shouldn't have shot that forward, but oh well. That was a waste of a bomb bomb. Oh, there you go. He didn't do anything before. Maybe he was just too. Ooh. Oh yeah, I think I went on this part of the course and I screwed it up. It seems like I'm doing better here. Playing in handheld, it was a little more tricky. Oh shit. Who threw that green shell at me that miss? Oh boy. I love the music. There's my banana. Can't get me with my own banana. There we go. Going under. Going under. I'll take this way right now. Usually I took the other way, but we'll take this way. There we go. Get a boost. Every time you do tricks, up those jumps, you get a boost. to the show, but it's not like I would have got it anyway. Oh, here comes the blue shell. Of course. Because why should I get ahead? They're going to slow me down there, copper. Oh, go, go. Good thing I'm super ahead. Oh, that's how you go look backwards. X is to look backwards, folks. I never knew that. But there's nobody behind me. Now there is, but I won. I almost lost the race, folks. I almost, I almost didn't get first because I was trying to look back, and I. <laughs> wow, old man, Mr. Mike, folks. Oh, crazy, crazy, Mr. Mike. Old freaky bastard, or old freaky gamer. Okay, here's Bowser's castle. Remember, it used to be 2D. Oh my God, that was shit. Somehow it got 3D. They upgraded the graphics a little bit. Hey, Bowser, this is your place. And the music rocks. Of course, you're going to throw a red shot on me right away.
Oh yeah. God darn those red shells. They're gonna piss at me. They're just throwing everything they got at me with those red shells. That was my fault. I knew it was coming, but I was being stupid. I said I was looking behind me. Oh, Bowser's in the lead. I can't let Bowser win. Sounds like a uh, Mario Party music. Uh oh, here we go. Red shell attack. I mean, blue shell attack. There's a blue shell and then there was a red shell. But the red shell didn't get me. This one did. Oh my god, those red shells. They're just shooting everything they got at me, folks. They really don't want me to win this. Oh, that banana. Oh. Ah, oh, crikey! Man! Get out of here, Bowser! Oh! Oh, what the hell? He had a banana or something? Yeah! Yeah, in your face! In your face, Bowser! Ah! <laughs> Look at that! At the last second! Oh, I thought he had me, and then he he must have hit one of the uh the gr uh what do they call them? The ground uh, what are they called? The ground pounders? I forgot what those guys are called. He hit one of them, it's I think, and then I was able to do a quick jump and show off kind of technique, so I got that extra boost. And I got to boost past the, the competition. Oh, that was great. I'm glad I got that on video because that was that was just the best. Uh-oh, Rainbow Road time. Now, did I ever mention to you guys, I always hated Rainbow Road. I don't know why. Bowser, you got bowsited. Your tricks did not work. Oh, here we go, red shells again. Yeah, watch out, don't go down the middle. That's bad. I found that out! Oh! I almost fell off the stage because I wasn't paying attention. Because there's no uh, guardrails on the whole thing. Woo! Yeah! Didn't I mention I used to hate Rainbow Road? This one's a bit better. The way they made this Rainbow Road, I thought they did a better job. Oh, how did that shell get me? No! See, that's what happened to me. This is how I lose Rainbow Road. Oh, I got hit with the red shell still. Them bastards! And I fell off the stage. 
right to planet Earth I go. Oh, now everybody's passing me. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Ah! Get away from me with those! Damn, second. And I'm first. Oh, now I'm second. Now I'm third. Now I am. Uh oh, watch out. Oh, yeah. Whoa, what's going on here? We're swapping. We're all doing some swappies. Oh, yeah, I gotta just stay away from these. These do not help me. Whoa, no, you Donkey Kong. How dare you? How dare you try to trick me to get in the way? No way. Come on, give me something good. There we go. Ah! God darn these red shells! Oh my god. Ah, they're coming right behind me. Go, 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 donkey. I mean, Diddy. Funky Kong, sorry. Funky Kong. Uh, uh, annoying. to the future, Artie! Artie! We're going to the future! Ah, shit. Bad place for a blue shell and a red shell! Oh, the red shell didn't give me that. That's good. Ooh, I missed that banana. And... Oh! Oh! Link stole the win! What the hell? Link just stole that. Did you see that at the last second? Link just snuck right in. Aw, oh, man. Oh, I still got... <laughs> I still got the win, technically. I didn't get a perfect for the perfect trophy, but... Wow, that was amazing racing, people. That... Wow, at the last second, Link stole them for the win. But I still won overall. Yep. Sorry, Link. You tried, and you failed, boy hobbit. He failed. Okay, so why don't we uh, do some... Uh... We'll try out some other the other characters and we'll call it a video. How about that? How about we go with Diddy Kong? Because Diddy did. And we'll keep the same thing. Uh, race count. We'll just do... Whoa, not 48. Oh, we can only do... We got to do at least four races? Okay. Uh... uh, uh, uh. I'll turn that off. Where's the other one? I'll turn that off. That off. Uh, rest of the stuff could stay on. And um, I like the day came mountain. Let's do some DK mountain. Might as well with Diddy. Diddy did it. Did he doing did he doing the decal mountain? Cause he's a part of DK's family. DK Donkey Kong DK DK Mountain DK Donkey Kong. Yeah, see they seem like they don't shake their hips as much as Pauline. Ah, he's got the little all right, all right. He's got the baby horn. He sounds like a monkey. He is a monkey. Woo oh, don't tell me. Oh, that is bull. Shit. 
How dare you? Who did that? Who was the one that did that? Sorry, Pauline. It might be beautiful, but I still... I still rule it's the monkey. I'm the monkey. Where's that red shell going? I thought there was somebody in front of me. I guess not. I guess I got first place. How weird is that? DK Mountain is helping out DK Jr. Donkey Kong. DK Donkey Kong. And somebody ran over my banana. Because they are stupid. Ah, you stupid red shell. Sure to turn off the red shells. They love to use those on me too much. And because it's not my fault that I'm in first place all the time. You guys are better racers. Hell yeah. No red shells. Look at that. Watch out for the rat! Oh, you almost hit that banana, dude. Good skills, good skills, good skills. Oh, another red shell! Wow, they, they, they're just really trying to hit me with those red shells. Like I said, it's... Oh, I fell off! That's okay. Go, go, DK! Donkey Kong, Diddy Kong. It's the Diddy Kong rap. Diddy, it's the last lap, Diddy. Hell yeah. I don't care. I won this one. It's gonna take a miracle for them to win. I should have said that. Cause they'll probably all shoot red shells at me next, watch. They'll be like, boom, 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 and I'll be like, ah! Oops, see, here comes a red shell now. And a green shell! What the freak? What did I tell you? Here comes another red shell. Didn't I tell you they were going to do that the last second? Didn't I say they were going to shoot all shoot red shells in? How did I say that? How did I know that? But they lost. It doesn't matter. You guys lost. Pauline, you loser. Loser. Holy cow. I, how did I say they were going to throw like red shell after red shell after? Oh, my God. They think I'm so naive. Okay. Let's see here. Yes, because I just want to go through. I don't want to do four. I don't want to do four courses. So we're going to go to race. We'll pick. Uh, for the me thing. Oh, it's just different costumes. I got all these costumes. So. Um, whoops. So I guess we'll pick Pauline, or not Peachette, sorry. Right. We'll do one more with Pauline. Let's see if Peachette shakes her butt. Okay, you know what? Gonna make it a little harder on you guys. Sir will have the triple red, uh, uh, red shells, but we'll get rid of the main red shell. Watch, now there's gonna be more red shells there. Um, let's see here. Let's do Bowser's Castle. With Peachette. DK Donkey Kong. I can't get that out of my head now. That's going to be in my head for a while now. There's Peachette. Let's see. Eh, she shakes. But she doesn't seem like she shakes that much either. 
I think Pauline shakes her butt a lot more than any of these guys. I don't know. I, that's why when we end up with Pauline, we'll find out if she really does shake what her mommy and daddy gave her. I know when they always say, oh, what their daddy gave them, but it was both the mom and dad they gave them. You know, it takes two to make a baby. At least most of the time. Uh, what did I do? Oh, I wasn't paying attention. That was all me. I'm still in first for some weird reason. Oh, Peachette likes to do a little, little jumping up on the thing and twirling like a ballerina. Yeah. Oh, yeah. See? Ha! I like to do the little sexy things with the ladies. Yep. Don't fall in the lava. Well, at least they brought me forward. Oh, I shot that forward, too. Sorry, my bad racing. Oh, there I go again. But it brings me up. Ah, Bowser got hit with something. It's like every time I fall in the lava, it seems like I get better. Oh, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, he, Mr. Piranha Plant has some fire power. See ya. I don't want to be ya. Wow. Hoo. <laughs> Peachette knows how to... Yeah, she's, she, can, she can really uh, move it. Still, I don't think, even based on the character and what they can do, I don't think they have, you know... I don't think each one has different... They have their own characteristics, but they don't have, like, any abilities that are better than the other characters. Going for the win. Nobody can beat me now. As he says that when he loses. Yeah. These courses are so much fun. Hey, Peachette. You look like Peach, but you're Peachette. Ooh, I like her noise. Sounds like a telephone. See one of those rotary dial? And we'll quit this. Yes. Like I said. And then we'll go back to Pauline. And we'll see if she shakes her butt more than the other ladies that we were racing with. And the other characters. Because I got a feeling they made Pauline a little extra... Wiggly. Here we go. Whoa. Okay, calm down, girl. She she's a little too excited. Um. I want to do TK Mountain again. I'm sorry, folks. We're gonna finish it off with DK Mountain again because I really like DK Mountain. It is a great course. This is one of my more favorite courses of the game. There's there's a lot of great courses that I will pick as a favorite, but for this last and final wave of uh, DLC, DK Mountain is uh, number one. See, she shakes her butt more than everybody else. Look at that butt go. Look at that butt go. It's not just me, people. It's not just me. She really shakes that butt. She shakes that wide and pride. It is not just me. They they really sexed her up a little bit. I, it's not just me, folks, right? I'm not just thinking dirty thoughts here about Nintendo characters. They really, uh, you know, sex her up a little bit more. Look at her those high heel platform boots. 
The other characters have regular racing boots. She's got these uh, heeled platform go-go boots. So don't tell me she ain't being the sexy, sexed up character. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> oh, it takes, it takes coins from me? Okay. That's okay. I don't need no stinking coins. I can get more stinking coins. Ooh, I'm gonna sit that. Look at those big old eyes and ruby red lips. What is that, a microphone? Oh yeah, she is a singer. <laughs> evil little, evil girl, right? She's an evil temptress. This one. Come on, guys, give me some good stuff. There she goes, with those high heel boots again. Like I said, she shakes her butt way more than that. Okay. And that fiery redhead. She's a definite fiery redhead. I think if it was between Princess Peach and Pauline, I bet your Mario would be uh, digging into Pauline a little bit more than Princess Peach, if you know what I mean. I, I think he would want, sure Princess Peach is like a sexy blonde, but Pauline, she's got some skills. She's got a lot of skills. But she can sing Mario to sleep with her beautiful voice. Whoopsie. She'd be like, Mario, whoopsie. Whoopsie, Mario. Whoopsie. Didn't pull out in time. Yes. That's for the adults. Look at her singing. Look at her. Oh, yeah. Look at me. Yeah, I think they really made her, like, the more sexed up kind of character. I know, like I said, I'm thinking dirty, but... Yeah, I think she waves her butt a little bit more than the rest of the characters. Even the females, because even Peach Ed and stuff were just going a little bit. Yeah. Anywho, folks. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Ooh, I forgot they had music where you could just listen to all the music in here. That's cool. So if I want to listen to Mario's Goldmine... Mario Circuit. There we go. So, anywho, folks, yes, uh, this is the final DLC pack, folks. No more to be cometh to anybody. At least that we know of. I don't know. I don't think Nintendo's gonna make or sneak in anything else. I, at least. To my knowledge I, I i believe this is all the rest of this dlc that we get and um it is a good end it's a good end to a good long run because mario kart 8 uh came out originally for the wii u back when nobody played it and then they said well when the switch came out they said why don't we just port it over and optimize it a bit and uh call it mario kart 8 deluxe and then we can work on the next mario kart 8 for the future and just you know this could be the mario kart 8 for the switch and they did a very phenomenal job at supporting this game and uh me purchasing the dlc outright just made this game 
uh, a whole lot better. A whole lot better. And uh, I enjoy every minute of this game. Like I said, I pick it up once in a while. I'll play the Switch. And you know what? I always like to just go out and play a bunch of runs of Mario Kart. And go around and play all these different courses and stuff. And there's so many courses in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe now. So many. And because this is so chalk-packed full of courses and characters and items and so much stuff to do, I wonder what they're going to do with the next Mario Kart for the next system. I, I have not the faintest idea. I heard some r rumblings. I think I talked about some of the stuff that uh, people were thinking they were going to do, but we don't really know. Nintendo will let us know eventually, but we don't know. But all I can say is, hey, if you're a Switch owner right now, this is the best time to be a Switch owner. This is the best time to own a racing game like Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Play with yourself, play with friends, play online, I think. And just really fun. Just really the funnest game. You know, the, the other only other game I know of that they supported so much with tons of DLC was probably Super Smash Brothers. For the, the switch so yeah very happy very happy and uh having a lot of fun so everybody this is mr mike showing off uh the late as i i did this very late uh the late uh showing off of mario kart 8 deluxe wave six of the dlc the final pack thank you for watching any comments questions whatsoever you can always email me at court. At, I always say it again. You can always email me at oldfreakygamer at gmail.com. That's oldfreakygamer at gmail.com. Or you can, you know, let me know in the comments section and on oldfreakygamer.com. The comment section is available underneath uh, my content. I usually keep all the comments off on YouTube just because. The only time I have the comments on on YouTube is probably for the podcast, so you can comment there if you really want to. Just make sure it's you let me know it's about Mario Kart 8 uh, Deluxe, and I'll read it on the podcast. So, anywho, folks, thank you. Thank you one and all. I'm Mr. Mike. This is Mr. Mike from OldFreakyGamer.com, an old freaky gamer, saying game on, game hard, world conquest. I am pushing this gaming button, and the show is now officially game over. Peace out, folks. <laughs>